What's up, everybody? Welcome to another edition of Mr. B's Baseball Breaks. Uh, we are here with the Mustachioed Muchacho, and today we are going to unbox a hanger box of the 2018 update series. Um, I feel like I've opened up a couple of packs in some of those, what do you call it, repackage boxes that you get at Walmart. But a friend of mine got this for a birthday present for me. Um, so shout out to my buddy for uh, sending this my way. I'm very excited to see what we got in here because these, um, they don't have at my Walmart. So I never get to pick these up. So uh, this is a retail hanger box. So it's going to be basically just the, uh, what do you call it? Just the pack of cards and like a cellophane brick. But there should be some good inserts in here and I don't have much of the set so there we go there's the brick of 72 cards let's see what we got in here don't know much about this set so i'm not sure exactly i know it's still it's fairly expensive in comparison to the series one series two of last year's set i don't know I don't quite know why probably because of cunha and whatnot so we got a nice little brick here now this is like the old traded set so you have the all-star game uh, you have uh, a lot of rookie call-ups. A lot of the trades that have happened will be reflected in the set. I'm very excited for this year's update series to come in. So there's a Wilson Contreras, Chicago Cubs All-Star. Jose Batista with the Mets. So he was traded quite a few times last year. I think he ended up... Did he end up with Philly or did he end up with... Well, there we go. Rookie debut card. So this is probably one of the cards that, of the base set that people are really looking forward to. There we go. Let's make sure this is focused there. Shohei Otani, rookie debut card. These are pretty cool because it tells you exactly how he did in his first game. I have a Glaber Torres of this. Okay, hopefully this is... I'm using a new phone. I got a new phone. I got the Samsung S10e, so I'm using the um, the wide-angle lens so it's a little bit easier. I don't have to like kind of stretch. I don't have to have like Mr. Fantastic Arms to show off the product. There's Christian Yelich. Nice munis there. There, Glaber Torres. There's a rookie card. I've already got this one, but I bought this, I think, on, on eBay. So there we go. Let's send it. Alex Colon for Seattle. We got JD Martinez, all star card. Francisco Liriano with the Detroit Tigers. J uh, Trevor Bauer, who threw a ball into the outfield the other day. We'll see. Uh, trade deadline is Wednesday if he remains an Indian. I don't know get what they're doing. They're hunting for a playoff spot yet they're gonna deal all their players and yeah it doesn't make sense oh that's cool manny machado and the dodgers freddie freeman one of my favorite players um two canadian parents so he played for team canada in the world baseball classic so uh, he was born in california but to two canadian parents and he embraces his canadian heritage always nice to see eduardo escobar for the arizona diamondbacks Tyler Beatty, rookie card. Miguel Gomez, rookie card. This set seems to have a lot of rookies, I feel like, from previous videos I've seen. Andrew McCutcheon, so I guess before he went to the Yankees last year. Another Batista. Gerson or Gerson, rookie card. Jeremy Hellickson for Washington. Javier Baez, all-star card. Junior Guerrera. Charlie Blackman, we'll see if he gets traded. Wade LeBlanc. Brian, Brian Dozier for the Dodgers. Flip a uh, Jacob Nottingham. I actually like, just speaking of the, the set last year, I, a lot of people complain about the lack of borders, but I actually kind of liked it with a little swoosh and both names on the same line rather than the f reverse this year. I think I liked last year's design better than this year. Uh, Kevin Gossman for the Braves. Scooter Jeanette for the All-Star Cincinnati Reds. Manny Machado, All-Star, but back then he was an Oriole. Sean Rodriguez, J.D. Martinez, that's just his regular card. Nick Girdwin, ah, oh, Jan Carlos Stanton with the New York Yankees. So, yeah, because I think in Series 1 and 2, he was with uh, the Marlins still. Well, I think he was only in Series 2. Hing Jin Ryu, Tony Kemp. Oh, that's cool. Luis Severino, and it's actually him pitching at the All-Star game with those All-Star hats. Joe Musgrove. Yerkson Profar, Scott Kennery, that's actually, a, I, I like this guy, he's pretty good for Philly. As I said in previous videos, I have a MLB The Show season with Philly, so I'm quite familiar with a lot of their 
recent last couple year um, update, uh, not update uh, prospect. So there's Scott Kennery's rookie debut. How do you do? Two for five with a stolen base. Not bad. Brad Hand, Ryan Tapera. Oh, there we go. So we're getting to the inserts part. We got Joey Musgrove, and again, I really liked last year with the 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 parallels, like the Mother's Day, Father's Day, uh, America, uh, Independence Day. They were a lot more pronounced with the cool, like this is the gold card. So that's Joey Musgrove. Oh, there we go. This is probably a nice card. This is a good insert. It's the uh, Top Salute uh, Shohei Otani card. There we go. That's a pretty cool card there. So we got two Otanis in here. Very good. And here we go. Joey Votto, Canada. International Affairs. So it's funny. I was talking earlier about Freddie Freeman embracing his Canadian roots. And then you got a guy who's went out and spoke pretty poorly about Baseball Canada. Um, almost acted like he doesn't care about it. Blah, blah, blah. Doesn't care about Toronto. Doesn't care. It all stemmed from um, last year when Paxton pitched a no-hitter. In Toronto, and then they asked him about it, and he just kind of he he kind of backtracked after because he got some bad press. But uh, to be honest, I'm not a fan of Joey Votto because of that. So, but there we go. So, international affair, Cincinnati. And again, I don't know much about this insert set, but I don't know. There we go. Hall of Famers, 2008, Trevor Hoffman. There we go. I actually like those unis uh, for the San Diego Padres. Oh, there we go. We got Hall of Famer Chipper Jones. Murray was one of the first players I remember, well, of the current contemporary baseball players with the, the knee-high socks, which is something I remember when I played. I always wore them like that. And back in the day, it was only Chipper Jones. Now every player seems to be wearing them like that. Oh, that's a cool. Don't blink. That's cool. Ricky Henderson insert card. Oh, ooh, that's a nice one, too. So that's the 1983 set. And he was, I think he's the big rookie last year. So that's pretty cool. A rookie card. Of Acuna Jr. Oh, there we go. Legends in the making. Young Carlos Stan. This is a really good, uh, a lot of good inserts here for players I like. And an Otani rookie card. So there we go. Another insert. So that's two inserts and the rookie debut card. And then Jason Talon. And there we go. So that's pretty good for inserts. You know what? I think retail, if I go retail, I'm going to start going with the hanger boxes. They seem to get quite a bit of you get a good stack of cards, which for me is good because I collect the base set. And you get uh, quite a few good inserts. Ryan Madsen. Juan Soto. There's another good rookie card from this set. Last year, there's a lot of killer rookies that came up with the whole service time thing. So they don't actually start early on. So it's they start, you know, in May later on. So that's why this updated series is pretty good. Uh, because you get to see all these great it's the first time you guys you get to see these cards uh, in a baseball set so there we go Juan Soto that's a good one put that in that pile rookie combos Walker Lockett and Jose Castillo that's a pretty cool card now, I don't think these players are any crazy good but that would be a cool card to get of like good rookies Zach Cozart did we just become best friends great line from Step Brothers. yeah so much room for activities in Fenway Park Mookie Betts and JD Martinez well, that's a cool card. Charlie Culberson, uh, Braves. Luis Valbuena. Unfortunately, I think he passed away in a car accident. And again, I'm not sure if it was a car accident, but I know he did pass away in the offseason. So tough luck for the Angels. They lost to Skaggs this year as well. We've got Anthony Banda, rookie card. Cole Hamels for the Cubs. Il Demaro Vargas, rookie card. Joey Wendell, rookie card. Nolan Arenado, all star card. Jose Abreu, all-star card. Jason Kimbrell, all-star all -star card. Tyler O'Neill, rookie card. There we go. I have his uh, short print from this year's Series 2 Future Stars card. Joey Lucchesi. That's kind of cool. You can kind of see the ring. John Hicks. Rajah Davis. That's a pretty cool card. Reminds me of like a stadium club card. Cameron Mabin for Seattle. Doing fairly well with the Yankees, though I still kind of wish they would bring up Clint Frazier. I don't know what, like, I think the team has to lose all their players before they'll even think about bringing up Clint Frazier. Uh, Mike Gerber and Grayson Greener. There we go. I wonder if there's one for each team, because it seems to be, it's pretty cool. Brendan Mann, rookie card. There we go. Alyssa Hernandez and Miranda Gonzalez. There we go. Oh, rookie combos. Justin Anderson and Michael Hermosillo. And then there's Miles Mikolas. 
rookie card. All right, so that's uh, the video. Just finished right at 10 minutes, so hope you guys enjoyed it. Got some pretty good inserts here for a retail hanger box that I got for my upcoming birthday. So again, thanks for watching the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. What you think about update series. I'm kind of curious uh, uh, what you guys think about of the tops one, two, and update, which is your favorite and why. All right, guys. Well, I'll catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching.